hello guys welcome back to my channel in this video i'm going to show you how to fix security update kb5070109 not installing in your windows 11 version 25h2 let's get started solution number one go to search bar on your windows top here services go to system services and uh, go to app readiness right click on it go to properties here automatic uh, to disabled startup type apply and stop it okay and go to background intelligent transfer service right click on it and go to startup type disabled apply and stop it click ok now scroll down and go to windows update right click on it and go to properties and startup type disabled apply and stop it now go to this pc and go to local disk c and go to windows folder and scroll down and delete this folder software distribution hit delete You can see uh, this action can't be completed so go to your windows update again and go to properties here startup type disabled and stop it again and try again so the folder successfully deleted go back and go to view and go to show hidden items and go to program data and delete the folder software distribution hit delete now close it now startup type uh, automatic windows update and apply and start it again and scroll up now and go to background intelligent transfer service right click on it and property startup type automatic apply and start it again so all right start it okay and go to app readiness right click on it and properties startup type automatic apply and start it again and okay now here close it go to startup and uh, tap here control panel go to control panel system and go to uninstall a program go to turn windows feature on or off and enable this option net framework okay you have to check these all options here and install net framework 3.5 and click ok wait for some time uh, while installing net framework after installation you need to restart your pc go to startup and restart your pc now solution number two go to search bar on your windows and type your cmd Go to command prompt, right click on it, run as administrator. Now use this command line. You can copy these command lines from the video description. Copy these all command lines and copy and right click on it, add it and paste. So wait for some time, minimum 10 or 15 seconds. Scroll down. Now it's done here and close it now. Now try again. If you're still facing the issue, then go to search bar on your Windows and type here control panel again. Go to control panel and go to a large icon and go to power options. And go to your uh, selected power plan. So I have uh, selected balanced recommended. Uh, so click here and go to uh, change at once settings power settings and here sleep click here and select from here never so all that is selected never after uh, selecting click on apply and uh, click here and select this one never okay now click on apply and go to turn off disk uh, after and select from here never by default uh, selected 15 
but after selecting Navo, apply and OK. Now close it. For more settings and solution, go to search bar on your Windows and type your CMD. Go to command prompt or right click on it or run as administrator. Now type here SFC space slash in now. Press center on your keyboard. So this process will take some time, minimum five minutes. Wait for five minutes while verification 100% complete. So after five minutes, you can see verification 100% complete. Now use this command line. You can copy this command line from the video description. Right click, add it and paste. Press enter on your keyboard. If you're facing uh, any error while using this command line, then I have another solution. But we need to wait for some time, minimum 10 minutes. So in my case, after five minutes, 100% complete. If you're facing any error while this command, then use this command here. Close it first. Go to CMD again. Run as administrator. Right click on it. Add it and paste. Press enter on your keyboard. Now press Y on your keyboard. Press enter. Now restart your computer. Go to startup and restart your PC. And do not press any button on your keyboard. Now here you can see fixing C stage 1. It will take some time, minimum 5 or 8 or 10 minutes. It will fix some corrupted files on your local disk C, C drive. So after 5 minutes, Now try again. If you are still facing the issue, then I have another solution. Go to search bar on Windows and type here settings. Go to system settings and go to Windows Update and turn it off here. If you are still facing the issue, then go to system here and scroll down. Go to recovery and fix problem using Windows Update. Okay, reinstall now. Check this option here and OK. It will fix corrupted update files of your Windows. Wait for some time here. I hope this tutorial helps you and please subscribe the channel, like the video.